we're making a green smoothie this morning. I can't remember last time I had a green smoothie. Uh, last night I had a dream that I got married. I don't know why I just thought I'd tell you guys that, but <laughs> good morning. I've also like been logging in my mood and like overall how I feel on the health app on the iPhone. And it's actually really cool. Like I really like it like looking back at it. Who remembers these old pomegranate containers? Remember when they used to do the pomegranate juice, like the tea in the glass? Ugh, I miss it. I'm so glad we saved these because they're so cute. One of the things I put in my vision board this year was to like eat more greens. I mean, I do a fairly good job at eating greens, but I think just like finding any way to implement it, whether it's like in a smoothie. Ooh, that's good. Also, I've been taking this vitamin C collagen every morning. It's by this Korean brand called Onus. I've actually been sticking them in the freezer because they taste like pop. They taste like popsicles. Ever since I started freezing these ones, they've been game changer. Look at this. I usually just nibble on this while I'm making breakfast. I just got home and I got an envelope from Say Beauty. It says, high priority mail. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it says, blow up this biodegradable balloon to find out when it's launching and then mark your calendar. So can we, let's get into the detail. Okay, love the wax stamp. Oh, God damn. Instant skin confidence. How cute is that? Look, let me say beauty. Let me get on the marketing team because this is so cute. Last night, I think I slept like 10 hours. I'm gonna do like maybe three or four laps. But speaking of laps, I have lately been feeling inspired to start like running again. I couldn't really train for like a marathon, or maybe like a half marathon. I played softball growing up my entire life. And when I played softball in high school as well, we had to, I think we switched from like semesters to quarters. We had to choose like a sport and for conditioning and I chose a cross country. I actually miss it. And I think that was the time too when my parents said like, that was like the best shape I'd ever been in. It's like up on Amazon looking at like running vests. Oh, we're gonna sit for a second cause this sun right here is hitting. I actually lost some weight after my surgery and like even this is just like really big. Also, do you guys go on like little morning walks or afternoon walks, any type of walks during the day. Also been trying not to like listen to music all the time when I'm walking and just like appreciate the nature sounds and the birds and stuff. I got two packages this morning. Also I look crazy, it's just a collagen little toner mask thing on my forehead. This one is from Say Beauty, my fave. Oh my God. The new slip tint radiant concealer. Are you joking? Look at this. Shut up. It's the wax seal for me once again. I really love their packaging. It's so pretty, oh my God. Next package is from Estee Lauder, Dr. Jar. Oh my God. These, you hear me speechless. God, oh, poor Remedy. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh my God. It's the handwritten note for me. here at Blue Bottle because Tower 28 is doing like a little event thing that's like really close by and apparently they're giving away like a bottle of the 
rescue spray or the SOS spray. I have the mini size and I like it so far. My favorite thing to get at Blue Bottle is the Sweet Latte and the Cascara Fizz. Highly, highly recommend. I'm starting Giovanni's room again because I started it a couple months ago and I don't know what happened but I got sidetracked and I just never finished it. So I'm gonna try to finish this today because this is like a really short read and a lot of my friends have read it and loved it. <music> Sounds so good. Look at the packaging, it's so pretty. I've been thinking about getting bangs. <laughs> I don't know, I kind of want to get it done in Japan because like anything beauty related is so much cheaper in Asia. So cute, like isn't that so cute? I don't know, I'm thinking about it. But my hair is like wavy, like I'll show you guys. By the way, it's wash day, that's why it's like hella oily. This is my hair. Do I want to get a Japanese hair perm? I don't know oil my hair before i shower my little sister she said she oils her hair and like lets it sit for, for like 30 minutes sometimes like 40 minutes I'm actually using the miel rosemary mint one but it's the light version because i've used the regular one and i felt like it was just way too heavy for my hair so i was like mm, i don't think this is working for me <laughs> my scalp massager i just do this this was so good especially when you go slow yes okay real quick before i hop in the shower it's spring and i really want to wear like really cute like kitten heels look how cute these are guys the bow can you guys see that oh my god so cute i ordered these from chinese laundry but from amazon because they have a chinese laundry like storefront on amazon these were only like 42 bucks but then like on their actual website they were like 60 something and i was like make that make sense i think i'm gonna start a kitten heel collection because i've been obsessed and like i don't know i just something about them makes me feel so like elegant <laughs> Actually, at my emo's house because I'm like babysitting my cousin who's on spring break. Oh, not the face mask. Is this done? Okay, I think this is done. Yesterday we went to Americana, we went shopping, and today we're gonna get like our nails and toes done. I've been curious to try this liquid IV. I see it everywhere. I think it's supposed to be like extra booted hydration and electrolytes. The watermelon flavor. I also found a therapist that I really like. We met yesterday for the first time. I told you guys that since I'm moving to Japan, I really wanted to find an online therapist because I am gonna be working full time and just like having the convenience of having a therapist at home is just something I really need. Oh. This is supposed to be like a Gatorade. Wait, why does it taste like Mexican candy? Like it tastes like Lucas. Oh my God. Yeah, it does. Hope you guys are having a beautiful day. Good morning. This morning, we're going to go to my friend's cafe called Canyon Coffee. I still haven't checked it out. I did pick up Stoner by John Williams. So I think I'm going to read this a little bit in the cafe. Get my little morning started. I actually got this from Stories here in Echo Park. Did I finish the other pile of books that I have sitting in my room? <laughs> no, but you know what? Life is too short. Canyon Coffee was a fail. I literally drove past two times and the line was out the door and I was like, you know what? I think I'm okay and all the seats were taken. This afternoon, I'm actually gonna get lunch with Grace and we're gonna go to Squirrel. She's actually never been and Squirrel is actually one of my favorite places. Sika Pear stuff is so good and it has SPF in it. They're just like little drops that you just put on your face for like any redness. Little goes a long way. Let's go get some lunch and enjoy the nice weather today. Let's try. Okay. Be honest too. We got okay. Foodie over here. 
teeth the thread is like really thick yeah so if it was thinner i feel like it would taste the jam better mm. the jam and the ricotta it's good it's right so good. So, good. so good you guys have to get this if you yeah. come here so good and really this good. we killed this i know <laughs> Matcha. I got a cream top one though. Mine's pretty good. I'm basic today. I just got a hot one. <laughs> the weather is so bipolar. It's like cloudy but sunny. Yeah, but then windy nice. but it's like crisp. <laughs> but I'm wearing a you know it's because I'm wearing a tank top. Oh. That's why I'm like, let me get a hot drink yeah. so I don't get pneumonia. <laughs> As a content creator, it's easy to get caught up in the highlight reel of other people's lives, especially when you're constantly seeing your friends and colleagues seemingly thriving in their careers and personal lives. I found myself falling into the trap of comparing myself to others, feeling like I'm somehow behind or not measuring up. It's a challenge that's been weighing on me heavily lately, and I know I'm not alone in feeling this way. That's why I'm so grateful for today's sponsor, BetterHelp. As someone with a full-time job who also does social media on the side, I understand how difficult it can be to prioritize your mental health and well-being. BetterHelp makes therapy accessible and convenient, no matter how busy your schedule may be. They offer online therapy sessions that you can do from the comfort of your own home, whether it's through video chats, phone calls, or even messaging. One of my biggest goals this year is to focus on building healthy friendships and stepping out of my comfort zone to maintain those relationships. I truly believe that therapy can be an incredible tool in helping me navigate this journey. With BetterHelp, you can get matched with a licensed therapist who specializes in the areas you need support in, whether it's self-esteem, relationships, or anything else. And the best part, you can get matched with a therapist in most cases within 48 hours or less. I know firsthand how transformative therapy can be and I want to encourage anyone who's been struggling with comparing themselves to others or feeling behind in life to give BetterHelp a try. You deserve to prioritize your mental health and well-being and BetterHelp makes it easier than ever to do just that. So go to betterhealth.com slash anyangskaya or select anyangskaya for a special discount off your first month of therapy. Take that first step in investing in yourself and your mental health. You won't regret it. Before I end this video, I know I owe you guys a monthly favorites. So this is gonna be like a February slash March. Oh my God, it's March, end of March already. Favorites, real quick, really important reminder. For anyone that booked my COVID trip to Korea, I just wanna put out a friendly reminder that payments are due May 23rd. I don't want anyone to freak out because I believe you guys do get emails saying like, when your payment plans are due. Just thought I'd put a little reminder out there. I have been wearing this bag literally every day and it's the perfect size. I get so many compliments when I go out. People are like, oh my God, where'd you get your bag? The brand is called Donki and I got it from Mushinsa from Korea because they ship worldwide. This bag is like really trendy right now. Like this style of bag, it's kind of like the Japanese schoolgirl bags. For comparison, this is the Stand Oil Chubby bag that I know like everybody has right now. It's like super trendy. I like it and I was wearing it a little bit like every day, but it's actually a little too small and a little too narrow. And these straps kind of get in the way. Like when I set it down, it just kind of like, I don't know, it's weird. You guys can see for comparison, this one is bigger and I just need a little bit more space. So I bought this one and this one was actually cheaper. Open here. I love that like it looks like a one pocket, but like it's actually two different slots right here. Ugh, love love and the bag just sits easily on your shoulder yes this is the tower 28 sos daily rescue spray and you put this on like literally any time of the day it's an am pm type spray before putting on your moisturizer and it helps with just like calming your skin down so if you have any like redness or irritation if anyone has eczema i believe it's certified by the national eczema association and i started off with the travel size and ended up getting the big one because i loved it so much so i'm gonna take this with me to japan i personally get a little bit of irritation sometimes from like if i try new products and it just is not working with my skin i'll get a little irritated and i'm like oh no this is not it this right here literally will calm your skin down i literally carry this around with me everywhere and it's also just like a good like hydrating refresher throughout the day so love this last item is this kimchi puff puff pass it's a set and bake powder i don't bake my face whatsoever like i don't wear a lot of heavy makeup little sister told me to try it because she had it in her room and very 
very little goes a long way like it looks so smooth it almost looks like a filter so like what i'll usually do is i'll just wear a little bit of concealer and i'll just put this on top just to like finish it off and it sets so well this is in the shade peachy there's a lot of product in here those are pretty much the only items i had for monthly favorites i've been trying to be more cautious of my spending and not just like buying a bunch of frivolous things i love lippies i love books i'm trying to be more careful with my spending so i didn't really have too much let me know in the comments if you guys have used any of these products but yeah that's gonna be the end of this week's video thank you guys so much for watching and i'm so excited to go back to japan like y'all i'm about to be on my shit you guys aren't ready let me calm myself down though because i also have to like listen to my body and like not go overboard thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys next week bye